hurts and pain. Pain I can feel. Somebody's up in that monolith with their hand on a knife. Crow calls it the witness. And what it's doing out here has a name too. The final shape. It's the end of everything. So I figure, might as well try to stop it. I know I said it already, but it is good to see you. Just wish it were under better circumstances. It's... it's good to see you too, Kate. I never thought... Hey, it's all right. I get it. This is a lot. And as much as we both want to catch up, we ain't got that kind of time yet. We gotta get out there and find Crow. I was expecting him, not you, and that ain't a good sign. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. We can save the celebrations for later. Guardian, we should... Can we talk for a minute first? Just you and me? I'll give you two some privacy. Last I heard from the kid, he was out on patrol. Called in some sort of darkness anomaly. I'll scout ahead. Catch up with me when you're ready. So, Cade, I looked him over while you were talking. Scan says that's really him. There's a few readings I can't explain. He's made of light, like me, like the Traveler. Ghosts are guides, conduits for the light. Cade might not be able to wield his as a weapon, but if he's like me, maybe he can share the Traveler's light, like we do. I'm not sure. This is new. But look what else we've gained. I can feel it. The way the light flows through you. Freer. Harmonious with darkness. A full chromatic spectrum. I've only experienced something of this magnitude once before. When the Traveler created ghosts to raise guardians. When I was born. We're going to need everyone to save it from the witness. Kate's got a lead on Crow and Glint. Let's start there.
Feels a bit strange being back on this side of the comms. Just like the good old days. Now, last transmission I got from Crow was just before you showed up. You said he and Glint were scouting ahead. Right. He called in some sort of anomaly, said he'd sniff around the perimeter. Personally, I prefer a little more direct approach. tell you about the hunter vanguard before me his name is andal brask he was my mentor great shot terrible gambler still we had this friendly little wager about what was inside the traveler i told him there's nothing so of course andal says well then i'm betting on everything <laughs> everything ah, lucky guess the inside is a composite of the outside you're gonna see some things you recognize, and some things you don't. Treat it all as real. Unless it ain't. But I can guarantee you the Shadow Legion up ahead are as real as they come. from our vision. That can't be a coincidence. Let's follow it. Kate, is that you? Glint, where's the damn kid? I've been trying to raise you both on comms for hours. Gone. The hell do you mean, gone? The anomaly we were investigating, it's... a construct of darkness, I think. A, a cave mouth. It felt... Wrong, like it doesn't belong here. I begged him not to go inside, but, but you know how he is. I tried to follow, I did. I did. That barrier, this place, the cave, it's, it's impossible for me to push past it all. Stay where you are. We'll find a way through. These locks control that barrier between us and Crow. Aid? Any ideas? Oh, I was never good at puzzles. It was always more a chorus thing. I think 
Those taken scions might share a connection with that dial. That's it! Do you see any other dials in the area? Affirmative. A guardian will handle you. Please hurry, Guardian. Crow has no one to raise him if he falls. Glint, this ain't your fault. He's my guardian. My responsibility. And you're his. I know you want eyes on him. But you need to stay out of sight until help gets there. <clears throat> Kate, what do you make of that bird that led us to Glint? Well, it seems pretty obvious to me. I think it's pretty obvious to you, too. The real mystery is why nobody wants to say it out loud. I will. A traveler. It's helping us.
This must be it. Clint's right. This feels cancerous. Like a blight. But it's different somehow. I... Ah! What is this? Indecision. Guardian. You were thrust into an unending life of certitude. It's in my mind, trying to tear me apart. Let us free you from this architect of your enslavement. No! Ah, I, I did it. I fought it off. Shut it out. No matter. Our voice will suffice. It is but a fact simile, a testament to loyalty, an expression of longing. Crow, we see his heart held in talons. We hear it beat with his twin sister's squeals. Within the final shape, we offer the vision of our pride. Of yours, friends, looking to him with trust. But, like you, he chose pain. You use the darkness to exploit Crow's memories? And the light to give them form. Don't you see how beautiful it all could be? We offer it to erase Prince Aldrin's stain from the Dream City. To grant Crow dominion of the Reef, the Awoken, and all the stars beyond. But he chose pain. Subjects himself so completely to your 
prowler. This move was taught, conditioned into you. It can be unlearned. Quiet. Listen. I've seen these veiled statues before. You have too. It's whispering something, but I can't quite make it out. Stop listening to it! I told you to wait outside. This place is... I don't know what kind of effect it's going to have on you. He's right, Glint. I don't care. He doesn't get to make those decisions for me. We're supposed to be a team. Guardian and Ghost. That's how the Traveler made us. I'm sorry. Don't ever leave me behind again. Promise. I promise. Let's set up camp outside. Kate's not far. Of course he isn't. Tell me you got the drop on him at least. You and the Guardian both need bitter boots. Well, maybe I'll get lucky this time. It's hard to describe. It's like these pockets of darkness are physical manifestations of the witness's presence here. An infection festering. You said it spoke to you. In the dark, tempting me. The witness knows what's in our hearts and minds. It promises to make it all real as part of the final shape. Listen, whatever the witness is doing to the traveler, our ghosts can feel it too. And it's spreading. Ikora would know what to do. Oh, don't worry, kid. We'll find her. Even if we have to blast our way through. I don't think it's that simple. Sometimes it can be. Let's just get our bearings again, refocus. Agreed. What a relief to see Crow and Glint again. That cave we found him in, where the witness tried to possess me, 
A malignant place like that inside the Traveler feels... blasphemous. That wasn't just darkness. It was reshaped by the witness. Corrupted. No wonder it could project itself there. At least out here, the Traveler's Light still protects us. As much as it can, anyway. My shell? <sighs> Don't worry. It's not as bad as it looks. The witness barely left a crack. We take hits and we get back up again. Right, Guardian? Listen, the others spotted a location nearby that resembles the Io Cradle. Sounds like something that would be of interest to a warlock we know. Helm signal. Mara, we can barely hear you. I'll try to boost the connection. Pro? Does this reach you? She can't hear us. I'll keep trying to clean up the signal. The portal remains unstable, and your enemy has barred the way behind you. The abominations you encountered are of the witnesses' making. This is but a fraction of the power it now wields. Using stolen light. It has created a new army in opposition to the one the Traveler raised. Stewards of the final shape. No matter. The Coalition convenes to devise a method of dispelling the Witnesses' interference. Keitel and Misrax have promising theories. Once this desperate attempt to slow us is left broken, we will rejoin the attack. Let my voice send you now, in flight, to strike down the Witness and all its followers. Go with hope and with vengeance.